In example A, we'll be calculating a payout annuity using the TBM solver. You just received a million dollars in the state lottery and want to know if it's enough money for you to retire now. How much can you withdraw every month for the next 20 years if you put your money into a payout annuity earning 4.5%? Want to use the TVM solver to determine the variables from the problem. Hit the apps button, followed by enter for finance and enter for TVM solver. In this case, we have 20 years times 12, which is our compounding monthly. If we arrow down to the interest rate, we have 4.5%. The principal value for this will be a million dollars. I'm going to make this one negative. Arrowing down to the payment, we'll skip for now because we want to figure out how much we are going to be paid monthly. The future value, in this case, will be zero after the 20 years. The payments per year and compounding periods per year will be 12, which in this case we don't need to change. We'll arrow back up to payment, hit alpha and enter to solve. So we can withdraw $6,326.49 every month for the next 20 years. In Part B, we want to know how much can you withdraw every month without reducing the principal balance of a million dollars. One way you can do this is to use the simple interest formula, I equals PRT, taking a million times our interest rate of 4.5% as a decimal, times the amount of months, which would be 1 out of 12. This would give us a payment per month of 3750 which will allow us to withdraw without touching the balance of a million dollars. The other way we can do this is use the TVM solver and set the principal value, or the present value, equal to the future value, just keeping the signs opposite. Let's go ahead and put this in. We go up to our N. We want to find the interest for only one period, so we'll put in just one here. We'll keep the interest rate the same, our present value the same for negative one million. We'll skip the payment for now, go down to future value and make that a million dollars positive. Going back up to the payment, we want to solve for payment by hitting alpha and enter. You can see this matches our simple interest formula as well.